Hey everybody, thanks for stopping by. In the latest version of Shotcut, they've made it super easy to add an animated subscribe button like this. Let me show you how, it's super easy, let's go. All right, well, with Shotcut's latest update, they've made my previous video almost obsolete, so I thought I'd just do a new tutorial and give you all an update. It's really easy. First, you just need two things. You'll need the clip that you want to edit. I'm going to go ahead and drag that down here to the timeline. It's just a talking head piece right here. And I'm going to try and maybe put the subscribe button right there. What I do is I come down here. I add another video track. I'm going to drag this animated subscribe button to there. I'm going to leave a link in the description where you can download this one. Make sure to use a Chrome browser because I think some other browsers have trouble downloading this green screen. But anyway, as you can see, I'm going to just play it from the beginning here. There's a talking head of me, which I've muted for right now. And you can see there's that animated subscribe button. Now, obviously, we've got to get rid of that green screen. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make sure that the green screen is highlighted. I'm going to click on filters. I'm going to hit the plus sign and in the search bar I'm going to type chroma key simple C-H-R-O you don't need to go any further it's right there on the bottom chroma key simple I'm going to click on it and there you can see the green screen has disappeared but obviously we have a big old subscribe button so we need to downsize it and then move it to where we want it so the next thing we're going to do is with again the green screen animated subscribe button highlighted which it is right now I'm going to hit the plus sign again and we're going to search for size and there you can see it it's called size position and rotate so we'll go ahead and click on that and you can see now we have this big box so we can drag from any corner to resize and then just move this subscribe button so I'm just going to go down here to my bottom left I'm going to shrink it down once I get to the size I want, I just go to the middle here, you can see right there, and kind of maybe just drag it here. But again, in your scenario, you can drag it to wherever you want and make it as big or small as you want. So now, when I play it, you can see that's right there. I'm going to chop this end off. I'm going to render this video and we'll see what the final product looks like. So I'll be back to you in right now. All right, well here is the final product. Have a look. A few weeks ago, I put together my third computer build of 2020. It's the Ryzen 5 3400G. And there you go. Just really super easy with the latest version of Shotcut. If you found this information at all useful, hey, please give me a thumbs up. And if you're feeling generous, please consider subscribing. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye, folks.